Hey everybody, Rookie and I'm handicapping thoroughbred racing from nearby Charlestown Races and Slots Casino, Charlestown, West Virginia, on Thursday, August the 11th, and this is my day at the track.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 tonight, folks. 9 58 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 6.5 for a long sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, 3 years old and up, race for an allowance purse at $28,000. Contenders number three, Centripetal Motion, number eight, CC Alexandra, number six, Glackety, and number four, Fun of the Game. Number three, Centripetal Motion, a six-time winner, sprinting at her about six and a half furlongs on the dirt. In her career to date, is the overall speed leader in this field, has hit the board in power run fashion in four straight, including back-to-back-to-back power run wins in her second through her fourth races back. Jockey Eric Ramirez has been in her irons on five previous occasions, hitting the board in each, winning three en route to a positive 374% return of investment in the process. Is back today for ride number six. Number eight, CC Alexandra. Nice early speed abilities. The complement for this sprint is the pace profile leader. Comes off a nearly 10 length power run win in her last start. Race 7 summary, number 3, Centripetal Motion, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 8, CC Alexandra, number 6, Glackety, and number 4, Fun of the Game, 3, 8, 6, 4 in the 7th from Charlestown. Bonus long shots, River Downs, race 6, number 5, Praying for Heat, 8 to 1 in the morning line, drops in class by 11 units, decent overall speed for this 5.5 for a long sprint. Canterbury Park, race 3, number 3, Minglo, an 8 to 1 shot, drops in class by 4 units, good speed for this mile test on the turf. So from Charlestown on a Thursday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over.